Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 17 of Dragon Age Inquisition. So here we are, let's say, assuming if we can just modify the weapon. Uh, sorry about the last episode, it just cut off because uh, I was too chatty and what happened was that uh, <laughs> our uh, the PS4 PlayStation automatically cuts off each episode once it hits like uh, 30 minutes so there is no 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 uh, what, why, why is that no 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 we don't want to do the Ferelden this one is what we want to do no so do we have any other Oh. What kind of rune can we put in it? I, I don't even know. How about the Ferelden Longsword? Oh, no. So currently, what is attached? It's a Ferelden Longsword Grip. And do we have a rune to attach to it? We don't have a rune. Huh. How about craft weapons here? Can we craft a weapon? Leaf mace. Raider hatchet. Arming sword. What is that? Uh, oh, 56 DPS. Apostate staff. Dense two-handed half. What's that for? Uh, so let's see a uh, pointed dagger grip. Firm bow grip. Ah. This one we can attach to. Can we do this? What kind of, uh, we have two leather. Crafting. Each crafting schematic has one or more slots. Each slot accepts a specific number of materials of either metal, cloth, or leather. Fill all available slots to craft an item. Crafting. There are five different types of crafting slots. Utility, offense, offense, defense, damage, and armor. The type of slot determines the stat that will be generated from the materials placed in it. For example, placing iron in a defense slot gives a bonus to melee defense, while putting it in the utility slot gives a bonus to strength. Okay, experiment with different combination of materials and slots to create unique items that fit your needs. Ooh, okay, so what kind of items do we have? Uh, crafting. Each crafting material has a predetermined stat value for each possible slot type, which you can view by examining the, the material. The final value of the stat coming from a slot is determined by multiplying this value by the number of materials placed in the slot. Okay. K9 leather. Oh, plus two dex. Fennec leather. Plus two dex. Nook skin, oh, plus two cunning. Ram leather, plus two dex. Oh, nook skin is actually good. Uh, and then, say we put it there, and then, so we have cunning, and then what do we put here? Canine leather, flanking damage bonus, wow. Fennec leather, critical chance, not bad. Nook skin, critical damage. Ram leather, flanking damage bonus. Critical damage like, looks good, right? Okay, uh, no, uh, all changes will be lost. Do you want to continue? Yes, okay. Dense two-handed half. What is this for? That's not, is that for a sword or is that for? How about arming sword? Uh, what is this? It has a 56 uh, DPS. Uh, 
what kind of metals do we have? Drake stone. Wow, plus 50 damage? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, uh, yes. What? What does Drake stone do? What does it do? Okay, let's go back. Uh, what does it do? Uh, why does it do anything? Summer stone. What does it do? So armor penetration. Four percent attack. Oh, I guess uh, this top part is the basic damage, right? Oh, I see. Yeah, because it is uh, selecting materials. Yeah, that is the okay. I see. I see. Uh, that is the blade itself. Right. Uh, okay. What? How? What? If we use iron, iron has to. We have so much iron. And then the bottom part gives the okay uh, armor penetration, and this one has plus four percent attack, stagger on the hit, eight percent guard damage bonus. Huh. We're not. Oof. What with Aaron? Plus four percent attack. So it'll be a simple iron sword. I guess a raider. Oh, hatchet. Hey, we can give this to uh, 108. 108. I think we can give this to Cassandra. Right? Who's this guy? Can you improve my equipment? Can you help improve my arms and armor? Yes. If you find a new piece, a pauldron or greaves, we'll take care of you. You can't just slap a new hilt on your sword in the field. Bring it here, we'll make sure it's done right and proper. Okay. Goodbye. Right. Let's check what we currently have. See our weapons. Mercenary Lord Blade. So we're doing like 83 damage. And uh, Cassandra has a. Uh, Cassandra has a. The sweet dish. The sweet dish. Fingers. Okay, I think if we build a weapon for Cassandra, it's only seventy three, right? The uh craft weapon. Let's do a leaf mace, uh just out of curiosity. We'll use iron. Oh. What? It goes down in damage to 74? What happened? Oh. How come it says 108 DPS? Oh, we're short on K9. Oh, it had maybe the 108 is uh, the potential amount of damage it can do, and it depends on the material. So, 
if we just use iron Drake stone still the same so if we use imp uh, what do you call this if we use uh, inferior materials okay I, I guess that's it if we use imp inferior materials it will not be it will not reach its potential okay uh, where is the merchant how about if we craft armor free army scout it has a hundred and fourteen armor rating versus uh, what is our current uh, so I'm just trying to remember what we can do here so what we have is the defender mail I think that's what we are currently and that's 86 okay so say let's see what we can craft here uh, that's 114 it's 30 defender that's 92 defender coat so free army scout oh we don't have we don't have 12 leather except ram leather right the only yeah we have ram leather so 114 uh that one uh what kind of really wow plus 80 maximum health Wow, that is good. That is cool. And then iron is what? 8% melee uh, defense. Stagger on being hit. Summer stone, maximum health. Whoa, this is good stuff. Let's plus 80 health. Uh, what is our current? Yes. What is our current health? Uh, let's look at our after record does it even say what kind of uh, it doesn't talk about oh attributes no no uh, it just show us the core stats so we have good health but uh, hmm. oh it does show us uh, we have uh, no, that's Inquisition perks. Let's look at details. Should be Constitution, right? The character's physical robustness and endurance. Each point increases health and melee defense. It doesn't say we just have. <sighs> Anyway, let's try this. Uh, let's at least build something. Ram leather. Yes. No, let's on the metal side. Uh, if we put Drake stone, 80 plus 80 maximum health. Let's say let's do that. And here we are short. Oh, we can have nug skin. Wow, that would have been canine leather. Nook skin would give us 8% cunning. Oh, it would be only, okay, restriction rogue only and restriction human trained only. So there is no point making that because uh, Varric is a dwarf good thing we didn't make it defender coat defender mail how about this uh, if we make this out of drake stone iron 
and this one would be plus four to constitution that's not bad plus four to strength plus four to constitution oh well we're not seeing anything really remarkable so we don't have really a good schematic so what we want to do first now is just to sell the stuff. Where is the merchant? Over here? Okay, let's just get rid of the stuff that we have. We'll need some of your cloth for bandages. Uh sell. We're trying to sell stuff. No no no. Uh sell. Okay. Sledgehammer, 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 sledgehammer. Disciple staff, reinforced shield, reinforced shield. What's the stiletto again? That's DPS is eighty five. Fire staff, ice staff. Oh, we can sell that because so we already have yeah Laura we gave Laura's a better a better she a better a staff we can sell that reinforced dagger aggressive bow as against the uh, longbow of uh, 67 and okay no that's gone fire staff brilliant staff is what is also a fire staff 32 tw fire damage fire damage Sell that brilliant, and this one is disciple of fire staff. Sell that Kunari battle axe. Let's hold on to that for a moment. Shocking Templar shield. Oh, we have to be level eight longbow. Okay, and then uh, on the Elven Cowl King Defender Coat Restricted Human Train Only. Oh, this is for uh medium adventure mode medium adventure mode 64 scout mail this is rogue only rogue only apprentice armor uh mage only elven cowl I don't think we need this. Uh, scout only. Uh, scout is rogue only. Wow, we have so many rogue armor. This is cunning. This is. Okay, medium adventure. Again, rogue only. I don't think we'll need those. Uh huh. These are treasures, right? I don't think we need any of these. Braid of rank. Figurine. Grouse feather. Personal locket, 
Prayer stone, silver bracelet, specialist crest. Maybe I think let's keep the the bronze acorn charm, eagle feather charm, Mabari totem, silk handkerchief, simple pendant, wooden crow figurine. Templar shield. Oh, this is level eight. Okay. Okay. Uh, much is Mother Giselle willing to oh, what are they selling? Uh, we did not check. Uh, mold. Oh, they're all pretty low level now compared to where we are. Okay, uh, the whole point was to come here and hopefully was craft items, but apparently we do not have enough materials. And the only thing that we can craft that was significant was uh, a rogue only kind of. So what is this over here? War room and this is Josephine, know thy enemy. Some items recovered in battle may let later be worth studying. Give an item to research. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> I think we've been selling we've been too aggressive selling. Did we sell something? Hopefully it it that isn't so. Uh okay. Uh we have this is like a learning process here. What are these? Your kind killed the most holy Lies. Your kind let her die. Shut your mouth, mate! Enough! Knight Captain! That is not my title. We are not Templars any longer. We are all part of the Inquisition. And what does that mean exactly? Back already, Chancellor. Haven't you done enough? I'm curious, Commander, as to how your Inquisition and its herald will restore order as you promised. Of course you are. Back to your duties, all of you. Okay, go to the war room and speak with Corporal Vale about the state of the hinterlands. Mages and Templars were already at war. Now they're blaming each other for the Divine's death. Which is why we require a proper authority to guide them back to order. Who? You? Random clerics who weren't important enough to be at the Conclave. The Rebel Inquisition and its so-called Herald of Andraste? I think not. If the proper authority hadn't completely failed, the Conclave wouldn't have been needed. So you suggest I blame the Church? and exalt a murderer? What of justice? That won't help restore order in the here and now. <laughs> order will never be restored so long as this rebellion is allowed to fester. widespread is the violence between mages and Templars? Impossible to say. Your organization flouting the Chantry's authority will not help matters. With the Conclave destroyed, I imagine the war between mages and Templars is renewed with interest. Yeah, who killed the, the mages Divine? Mages and Templars are fighting, even though we don't know what really happened at the Temple of Sacred Ashes. Exactly why all this should be left to a new Divine. If you are innocent, the Chantry will establish it as so. Or we'll be happy to use someone as a scapegoat. You think nobody cares about the truth? We all grieve Justinia's loss. But you won't grieve if the Herald of Andraste is conveniently swept under a carpet.
What? Uh, I'll return with good news and good luck keeping order. I, I hope the trip is worth it. I'll make sure they see reason in Val Royo. I pray you're right. You know what? Um, okay, uh, our timer just went off. So uh, let me cut the episode right here. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you will join me in the next episode. Bye.